Andrew Wiggins has really struggled his whole NBA career and could be considered a disappointment so far. But has he taken that turn and next step into the right direction? So what's good y'all? It's Matt LBG. The LBG stands for Let's Be Great. And we are back with another story video. If you are new to my channel, what are you doing? Hit that subscribe button and leave a like for more. And without further ado, let's get into the video, man. Alright, so if you have clicked on this video, you know Andrew Wiggins has struggled his whole NBA career. He just really hasn't lived up to those high expectations as a number one draft pick. Carl Anthony Towns has taken some of that spotlight away from him, but also Jimmy Butler did here and there. He just hasn't really thrived and hasn't been the main guy so far in his career. Every now and then he starts to show flashes of greatness really and puts up a crazy 40 points here or there and just shows great signs that he's improving. But then he just doesn't put it together he doesn't capitalize on that momentum let's be honest he can't shoot he's always struggled to shoot ever since he has entered the nba and one thing about this nba unless you're ben simmons you got to be able to shoot if you want to make a huge impact on the game and average 30 points per game you got to be able to shoot it's plain and simple maybe it's the system he's in maybe it's the coaching or maybe even it's his teammates. But one thing we do know is he hasn't lived up to that potential. And like I said, it hasn't all been bad. He has shown that he can play. And not only play, he has shown that he can play with the best of the best. But the one thing he hasn't done and he hasn't shown is that he can stick it and put it together for a whole season. And a big and main reason for that is just his shooting is really inconsistent at times. In Andrew Wiggins' last five games, though, he's put up 25, 30, 40, 25, and 33. I don't want to be one to jump to conclusions, but is this man taking the next step and turning the corner in his NBA career? If you do that for five games in a row, it's not a fluke. Something's happened. Now, I know the whole Lynn saying anything. He did that for about seven or eight games, but that was a one-time thing. And in these last five games, I've paid attention. His three-point percentage has went up and he shot the ball really well. And not only has his three-point field goal percentage went up, his two-point field goal percentage has went up and his overall field goal percentage has went up. I'm not a guy that just goes off of stats. I like the eye test, so I've even watched and analyzed his last five games. And he just looks better out there. He looks more comfortable in the system he's in. There's no question about his athleticism. We're not questioning that. He is one of the most athletic players in the NBA. But like I said, he just hasn't really put it together in his NBA career yet. So my question is, is this the season that Andrew Wiggins puts it all together and proves to us he is an all-star type of player? As of right now, it looks so as he's shocking me and he's really putting up great numbers. But here's the thing, like always, he's shown great flashes of success, but he has to maintain this. And one thing that's different than other years, I really don't think this is a fluke as he just looks comfortable, like I said, on the court. So I think he's going to maintain this success and maybe even do better, put up a 50 point game here and there if he keeps working hard. I really think Andrew Wiggins came into the league with the most potential in the NBA. But here's the thing, potential means nothing if you don't tap into it. So as long as this guy keeps working and keeps improving his shooting game and just overall game, I think he will thrive in the NBA. And you can't call this guy a bust. He's only played about five or six years in the league, so he's not a bust. He just needs to keep working and he will improve. But hey, man, with all this being said, that's about gonna wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys learned something. If you're new to the channel, what are you doing? Hit that subscribe button and leave a like for more. And with all this being said, 143, I'm at LBG. The LBG stands for Let's Be Great. I'm out, y'all. Peace.